The five of us stand here, waiting for elimination time to start. We wonder what the prize will be. Maybe it could be a work of art. All we know is one of us won't be getting one. We wonder what vegologists are hopefully something fun. The best part will be great and funny, seeing one of us get the money. Well, wasn't that a nice speech? And it was all true as well. But, let's see who owned. Be getting the money. We got 14 votes. Not much, but hey, we'll take what we can get. Today's prizes are hearts. I'm scared to ask, but who's here to lose it? I know what you're thinking, and no, these aren't human hearts. And two of them belong to you and X, since you both won the challenge. Oh, thank God for a second, I thought you killed people. Now then, on to you three. I'm gonna do something different. Instead of saying how many votes you got, I'll put them on the screen. And if your votes are the highest, then that means that you'll be eliminated. So, the results are... Wario is safe with 3 votes. And Gumbel is safe with 5 votes. And Sandy, I'm sorry, but... You... Are... Eliminated. We're not! I'm out! But I'm gonna take it like Mana did and keep my head high! So long, you four! And I wish you all luck! Goody! Does anyone have any idea where the host is? I don't know. We should be here because now is when we truly go honest. Hey guys. I'm back. So you're probably wondering where I went. So let me explain. So, around episode 9 and 10, I decided that, without telling anyone but TV, that instead of the finale being at the final two, it will instead be on the final three. I'm doing this so it works with the voting system. Okay, that makes sense, but where did you go? Well, due to the finale being on the final three, this is the last contest. So I went to the elimination place and asked the eliminated contestants to watch the live on a TV. Which they're currently doing right now. But, now onto that contest. This one is called, Dodgeball Extreme. How this will work is that I will shoot dodgeballs at you all and you need to avoid them. Instead of losing by getting hit once, you will lose by getting hit five times. Whoever lasts the longest will get a reward, which I will explain at the end. But now, let the challenge begin in three, two, one, go. Haven't any yet. Am I on a win? I'm still on a win.
I'll be honest, I don't understand why we have to watch the challenge. What do you mean is the final challenge the greatest experience in these kinds of things? And the actual greatest appearance is winning, but he's around there that besides I'd never listen and watch it something I'd hold before. Do you not have a TV? In his world, TVs don't exist because he's based off of a classic organ and they would instead have radios. Alright, I forgot, but back to my first point, watching the last elimination I can understand, but like, watching this just reminds me of how I didn't last that long and it could've been me in there if the viewers actually let me be a leader. You realize I didn't last long either as a leader too right, and I don't constantly complain. I'm not complaining, I'm just saying how my elimination was absolutely unfair, like, as soon as I don't have immunity, I'm eliminated, and also, not only was I eliminated second, I was the first newcomer gone. You at least had a bit of experience, even if season 1 wasn't that great. It may be real with y'all. Season 1 was mid. What do you expect when the average episode was around 2-3 minutes? I like season 1 better because I was in it more. Oh be quiet you egotistical narcissistic milkshake. They were talking, well here hoping that a bow hits one of them straight, the nuts. I said that out loud didn't I? Yeah, you did, and I agree with you. And there you have it. Wario, you are the only one who hasn't been hit five times. So you win. And like I promised, you get a reward. And it is. You get. To choose. Someone. To. Be. Eliminated. Go on! Well, I decided that instead of having an elimination next episode and have it be like two and a half minutes long at the least, the winner of the final challenge gets to decide the fate of the finale. So Wario. Who do you want eliminated? X. Gumball. Or Ezekiel. Take all the time you need. Um, this is interesting to say then. I don't really know the who I should get rid of. Wait a minute. I'm getting something in my head. Are you kidding me? Why would you give him garlic? His breath is gonna smell worse than already does. Oh, so my breath smells as a boy? Well, it's a lucky day. Because you won't be smelling it no more since you're out of here. Wait, what? Well then. It's settled. Gumball. Is. Eliminated. No, I was doing so well. I'm sorry. But the decision has been made. You're out. Nothing I can do. Why, what is that you? I guess this means goodbye. Yes, it tells them that we were so close to making the final together. But think of it this way. At least we went going against each other. I guess you're right. And hey, whenever you see Jeffy, make sure to give him what for. I away. And I wish you luck on the finale, Betty. Later, y'all. <laughs> Safe travels, my friend. Well, isn't this just interesting? We have our finalists. Wario. The gold-loving slob with a grave mustache. X the co-host of BFB. And Ezekiel. The Canadian home shield boy who is known for being eliminated first constantly. We started this season off with 18 contestants. After the eliminations, the merge, a rejoin, and some special guests throughout the season. It all comes down to this. Who will win? We don't know. That's why it's up to you viewers. Vote for either Wario, X, or Ezekiel to win character elimination, double or nothing. Whoever wins gets the prize of $2 million. Voting will end 96 hours after this video's release. So make your votes count. See. You. On. The. Finale.